Hello everybody and welcome to another part, another part, um, another episode of Bungle Collects and the second part of a two part special. We've got Ellie with us, the original, we are the original um, Bungle Collects crew and Ellie's here because we've got one final chance of filling her album and if she fills it she gets to keep it. Um, we did pretty well in part one didn't we? We won't give anything away, if you haven't seen it do go back to last week's and do have a look. We did find an absolute beauty so Jib Walter. He, uh, he definitely did the business for us because we, we're keeping him for as long as he, he brings us the look um, and, he did, and he has done well. I so I was a good luck charm. Well, That's hopefully. I used to be. Well, yeah, you will. Let's see. If you find that Commonwealth Games Wales and the writing is the, the way around that we want it, mm -hmm. then you get to take home your own book, you know, including some of the coins that you, um, that you put in there yourself. And we reckon, I reckon there's about 120, 130 pounds worth of coins in there, Ellie. So it's worth having, isn't it? And she gambled that she could have had the Bungle Collect badges <laughs> and signed Lady M and Bungle uncirculated bunny, but she decided to gamble it all for the chance of finding Commonwealth in Wales. So let's talk about this bag. We have got the RBS Haydock Cash Centre, Rock Hard Northern Cash Centre, in and around the Liverpool area, I believe, in the in the northwest. Dated 26th of November 2021, made it 1156 two pounds worth 500 pounds hopefully we're going to find some valuables as well as that one that we're missing but this is it this is the last chance um ellie i'm going to say lady m there the last chance we got to uh to fill your book before we retire the book all together and we move on to a book each for me and lady m for 50p coin on a 2022 challenge to try and fill the book within a year right off you pop then get uh get it open seal bags inside that's quite exciting we well, did roll can you cut wrapping paper you just goes straight across quite satisfying isn't it Ooh, nice. So the problem, they, we did roll the other bags before. Hopefully, you're hoping someone had cashed in, but they, but they haven't, although we did get some lovely ones. Now, these, Ellie, these are a pain. They don't have slits Aww, in them. I've seen you that. Yeah. For it. That's why they're called Rock Hard Northern bags, because the Southern <laughs> Softy bags have got slits in them. Uh, so the best... Oh, you see I just them. poked a hole in it. Yeah, well, so what, what I do is what your, what your mum told me to do was put your finger in there and then just rip that open. That oh. seems harder than what I just thought. Ah. I used to be much stronger. So, will we get it? Last chance before the book closes. Will we get Commonwealth Games Wales? Ah, I tell you what, we didn't get in the last hunt. And no two pound hunt is complete without the same pulse. We didn't get one of them in the last hunt, did we? No, we didn't. Yeah? Interesting. Very, 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 very unlikely that you don't get the same pulse because they are so highly minted. Over 10 million of them, Ellie. Um, right, we're kicking straight off with the Shakespeare skulls. Shakespeare tragedies. Does it have an edge inscription? It does, and it's the correct one. What a piece of work is a man. I'm going to put the Shakespeare's at the top. So that's the army centenary. The one with the army on. The Tron. Yeah, stop calling it the Tron helmets because um, people thought it was being disrespectful to the people in the armed services, so stop calling it that. Even though it does look like um, the Tron helmets helmet. But yeah, stop saying that. Right, this is a commemorative because it's got the GAC portrait on it. And it is another one. Another one of them ones I was just talking about. Lots of them. Nine and a half million of them were minted, Ellie. Oh, we're going that way, are we? Is that the, is that the way we're going? Uh, apparently. So what did you think of your first your first coin hunt in two years, then? Um, How did you find it? It was all right. Good. What would have made it excellent? I mean, I'm getting 120 quid's a pretty good thing, so finding that one, I'm gonna go with. Uh, you know, there's another skulls. Are you regretting the the turning down the uh, the bungalow lady um no. badges set? <laughs> no, I'm not. They might have sold by now uh, as well, like they're there. So I've got we filmed both episodes back to back, mm. so they might they might be I gone. I found another one. They might be gone forever. Ah, another Saint Paul's. Ah, can you read the edge inscription? That's quite a challenge to read it to read the edge inscription out. Another centenary oh. of the army. Good In up. victory, magnanimity, in peace, goodwill. Mm. That's you, not a cent. You did well with the magnanimity. That is really quite hard to say. Also, oh, who's the one who wrote all them books and things again? What's Charles Dickens. No, what's the name? Wrote the books, what do you mean? Oh, the one that you can never say. And they're on the TV oh. now and they're all them really like... Oh, yeah. Um, Agatha Christie. That's the one. That's it, yeah. Right. So 
So those of you that might be watching this for the first time might not know who Ellie is. So Ellie, also known as Ellie Belly, Belly Belly Belly, or sometimes Elephant or Helicopter. Ooh, we'll just stop for a silver fine, Lady M. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I know we look similar, but not that similar. We'll just stop for a Magna Carta. Look at that, that's a nice, that's a, a lovely silver find. One point. That was King Johnny, didn't that one? Ooh, I don't know what the Magna Carta mintage is. It's around about a million and a half. Ooh, I don't actually know what that is. Interesting. But anyway, Magna Carta, that's a nice one. That's the plum so far, uh, Lady M. Lady M's daughter. Um, <laughs> what was I saying? Before I got, got before I got stopped, I've lost my train of thought now. Mm, good oh, I think I was trying to see who you were. So you might not oh, know yeah. you might not know Ellie. So Ellie is the original collect um presenter who I used am to OG Bongo Collects member. OG, yeah. That's original gangster for all you older <laughs> people out there. I didn't know it was uh, Andy at Coin Cover told me what OG meant. So yes, Ellie and I started the channel in February 2019 and Ellie very quickly got bored. And we moved. were doing it in dressing gowns at the dining table. Can you tell why I got bored? Yeah, and I think you didn't like me kind of like directing you either, did you? You didn't like, because obviously I've, I want to help you out. I take pride in the channel and my name on the channel and... You know, your, your mum is so good at kind of going with the flow and putting up with it. Uh, She's this, done it for longer than I have. This is true. So. There's another Brunel selfie. Yeah, and I think you just weren't having it, were you? No. And you just, uh, you just ditched me. There's another Skulls, three three Skulls now. No edge inscription error, though. So, yes, so Ellie was the the, the, the part of the, the the original crew. It's, oh, it's upside down. There it is, Guy Fox. And uh, yeah, you've, you've appeared in a few, haven't you, over the, over the years? I was the first one. You could see my face first. Oh, right. Okay. You, you, did the, you did the face reveal. There's another. Uh, shopping centre. What happened to this one? I think it's been stabbed a few times. Yeah, it might have been like shoved under a pool table or something and really scratched. Uh, oh. So do you think you'll be joining us again, Ellie? So this is just a, a, like a two-part special to try and fill your book. Do you think, it, have, have, you, have, you, have you attempted to come back and... Do a few episodes. I mean, it's all right doing one or two, but like, I think that's some I feel for the time being. For the, just for the time being. <laughs> this one's very shiny. Look at it. Oh yeah, is it fifteen? Yeah. Wow, rotation error. No, that is very shiny. So the the reason why they because it's even though that's coming up for. Oh yeah. Nice. I'm oh yeah. You find that one. You play rugby, don't you? I do. So yeah, even though 2015 is getting on for seven years ago, mm. um, they're only just beginning to come out of the cash centre, so there wasn't a lot of demand for two pound coins. So a lot of the 2015 and 16 coins were minted in 2015 and 16, but they weren't released really into circulation yet. So that's why some of them are super shiny. There is the Darwin, Charles Darwin, origin of the species. I think it looks like me and Laughter. Laughter on the left, me on the right. Have you met Laughter? <laughs> Excuse me. No, I haven't. No. Um, have you heard? Have you heard a laughter? You I might... have heard of. You have heard of laughter. Everyone many, heard of laughter. Many, many times. Right. So, uh, laughter is uh, he shaves his head, so he looks like Charles Darwin there, and he sometimes grows a beard, and it's very long. So, uh, and obviously, I look a bit like a monkey. Right. How many bags have we got left? Five bags. Five bags. Five bags for the for your bonus prize. I forgot that's what we were looking for. Oh, that, that's a shiny 2013 as well. Lots of shiny coins in here. This is going a lot quicker than uh, last week's hunt, isn't it? I don't know. Ooh, another. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the one we just filmed. Oh, I didn't think I wasn't there, but yeah, that makes sense. Three bags to go, and whoever's the quickest here. We'll get to open the last bag. Can you get my out? Technology, 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 yes. Oh, I've got a commemorative. It's a one of them. Uh, I've got a slave. Yes, okay. yes. And now I get to go to use the last bag. Do you, do you, want, to, do you want to use the last bag? As a, This might be the last time you appear for a while. Yeah, give me one. Do you want to give you the last one? Yeah. There you go, then. Oh, look, it's another very shiny one. Here's your final chance for that Commonwealth Games Wales. Oh, yes. 
It's the last time anyone will see this book before it closes for good. And, and we me move. for the next three years. We move on. Um, nope. Hey. Must have not now, Feels like a magic wand, I'm like swinging it around my world. Hey. They can't even read that one. Which way around does this one go? That way. Is it weird when I stop talking? It's actually quite peaceful. Oh, two of them in a row. Oh, that's a nice condition. Mm. Is it 2007 there came out? Is it 2007? Uh, yep. Yeah, it's in nice condition, that. It's mm. quite uh, really quite shiny. It is 14 years old. Right, well, here we are, really. The end, end of an era. The book started and finished with you, because you were here for when... When we we opened we started the book, didn't we? So I picked the red one. Right. End of an era. Luckily, all the coins are still mine. She's gambled for it. It's been a Did pretty. Did I really lose anything? No. It's been a pretty no, cause yeah. It's just been sat in the filing cabinet, hasn't it? Mm. So you haven't really lost anything. Don't see it as a as a just see it as a. An opportunity to make an old man very happy. And also, did I actually need these? <laughs> Everybody needs that. Everybody needs a one of them. Right, okay, let's round this episode out with a couple of honourable mentions. And the honourable mention is both of them. Charles Darwin and the origin of the species. Is it the origin of the species on the back? Do you say origin? Let's have a look. Oh, of the species. Oh, where is it? I can't read it. On the origin of the species, on the on the origin, oh, on the origin. Okay, mm -hmm. so honourable mention there. But the plum, and I say I get the plum in this episode. Le, le, I say Lady M, Lady M's daughter. There is the plum. That's it. Nice silver find. Not many. Can't remember the mintage. About a million and a half. I'm sure it's less. It's definitely less than two million anyway. Sally tries to wreck the place. Mm -hmm. Right, and we need we need to round it out with a thumbnail. So we're going to can we do the can we do the can we do that one? Do you want to hold that one up? Because that's a honourable honourable mention. I'll zoom in a little bit. We'll thank Jib Walter as well, Jib Walter, because he has found us a Magna Carta. Right, let's do the thumbnail. Let me tell you what we're gonna what we're gonna do. Um, we found a football face. So obviously, if you're looking for a football for nearly three years. This was suggested by Family Clan, so you have to pretend that that's a football. I, I'm gonna, I think you should look away and then dive into it. Are you ready? So think of how excited you'd be to find a football. Are you ready? I'm thinking how excited you would Three, be. Three, two, one. <laughs> That'll do. Right, we're all done. Last chance to say thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode.